So it might start a little bit of hate or you might totally agree with me, but this is gonna be quite a big one, which is on 6 February 2018, Kylie Jenner posted this photo, which got around 18 million likes, which made it the most liked photo on Instagram. And actually last week on the 4th of January, some person, might be a genius, might be coincidence, but posted a picture of an egg and then it just blew up and it got around 44 million likes. And in this video, I'm going to discuss how this picture actually became the world record on the most liked photo on Instagram. Cause there has to be some kind of theory about it, right? You don't just blow up overnight and just get 44 million likes on a picture of an egg. So I'm going to jump into that with two reasons why I think this picture blew up and you can try to copy it but it's going to get pretty deep into some bigger issues which I explained in a previous video. So the first main reason people say is because that picture was part of a world record and people just like to People just like to attend into creating world records. It's just how it goes, it's fun. So that's the main reason. But this picture has 44 million likes and it only needed around 18 to 19 million likes to make it a world record. So how come this is still blowing up? There must be a bigger reason. Well, a lot of people agree and I agree as well. It's the reason because, woo! <laughs> The reason because of this is because people just hate Kylie Jenner. If you look into her comment sections of every photo, she's getting a lot of hate. So that hate on Kylie Jenner made it blow up even more. And besides that, we all know that traffic creates money. Traffic actually equals money. If you just look at the comments of this egg picture, you see a lot of people posting because of their own game. There's a lot of people promoting their own channels. There's a lot of people creating similar channels as world record chicken and world record egg and world record tomato. People just know that traffic is money and that's why they jump into it. But there's actually a way deeper meaning and that's what this majority of this video is going to be about. And that's the main reason why this photo got so viral. So if you just go to Kylie Jenner's Instagram page and I have it in front of me right here. You just, besides from perfect bodies and a lot of nudeness and stuff, there's also a video that got a lot of views. And it's just an example of what I'm, I'm meaning and trying to explain to you guys. But if we just check it out. It's just... Okay, what this creates is like a lot of people are watching this and a lot of girls are starting to think Oh, this is what my guy later has to do or this is what my husband has to do when he proposes to me or this You know, this only creates like a false reality because the chances are massive that guys are just not going to do this anymore What happened to the bring a rose after work and make your girl happy with maybe a bottle of wine or something it's just not gonna do it anymore and the reason for that is based on these stupid idiotic videos and we all know that particularly the young generation is on Instagram and social media and they all getting brainwashed of these new standards and girls start to think that this is normal and a lot of guys are just not going to spend one thousand dollars like they have to work really hard for that. Usually people to get $1,000, we're not all Kylie Jenners who have a lot of money. No, we need to work really hard for this. And if girls are going to start expecting this, it's just going to create a very hard position for guys, which makes people unhappy. So besides this, if we just go to my explore page, I'll just randomly open this up. If we watch the explore page, the first photo already, already proves that why the, why did, it just shows that girls have to have extreme big butts or something. Or if we just go further and scroll here, here's another photo. Empowerment is worth flaunting. I don't, what this basically says is that if you post something sexy and half naked, which is by the way, extremely photoshopped as well, because it's a photo on Instagram they say it's compared to empowerment. So being naked is empowerment. And 
girls might think like, oh no, this this means that this girl is com completely confident with her body and then posts it online. But if she were completely confident, she wouldn't use Photoshop. And we know a big issue in the world currently is that girls are being seen as sexual objects. And girls are fighting really hard to get rid of this image. And I agree, it's just a ridiculous image. Like for me, woman empowerment means uh, that they are intelligent, even more intelligent, even more intelligent than guys, is my opinion. That their potential to do great stuff is so huge that they need to be able to have the same careers and the same salary as guys. I totally agree with that, and that's what I mean by women empowerment. And if you see this, she's linking empowerment to nakedness and fakeness, and it's just really, really wrong. So the more we start posting this kind of stuff, the more guys are going to see women as sexual objects. And it's just obvious because guys are quite simple. If they see naked girls, they get kind of turned on in their head and they start thinking about girls being objects. So the more we start doing this, the bigger this issue is going to become. And what we see now is that especially younger generations actually think like, oh shit, so empowerment means I have to be confident with my body so what do they do they go on Instagram and they post bikini shots and have naked photos of side boobs and that kind of stuff which actually only builds the problem it's it's the main source of the problem of guys seeing girls as sexual objects which is totally wrong and again I know a lot of people are gonna hate me for this but this is honestly my opinion and all these problems creates insecurity with young girls or this cr creates bullying because people might start posting photos and the the body is just not perfect because it's not photoshopped or anything well it's actually a really normal body and people are going to start bullying and girls start to have an expectation that they need to have massive butts like kim kardashian so what do they do every day they go to the gym to create a butt and some girls have bigger jeans than other girls compared to butt growth <laughs> so it's it, it's just gonna create more and more insecurity and which in the end only creates less respect of guys having in women because they keep posting sexual photos and that kind of stuff and this is honestly my opinion why I think this egg photo became the new world record and became the most liked photo on Instagram and I understand that a lot of people just don't even realize that they agree with me they just like the photo because they hate Kylie Jenner but then I have one question why do you hate Kylie Jenner so one main reason could be jealousy you're just jealous of her and you want to have the life and body that she has but this only proves that you've already been brainwashed that you think Kylie Jenner is the new standard and that's how you need to look and need to act which is completely wrong it's just not the case so you being jealous totally proves my point. And the second option is you actually agree with me that social media is getting really fake and that there's a lot of fake posts and stuff going on and you just start liking an egg because you think that's the reason why I hate Kylie Jenner and that's the reason why I think an egg should, be, should top her. So I know this is a very bold statement and I just needed to make a video about this Honestly, there's actually two reasons I created this video. The first reason is actually the same as all these people promoting their own channels. I'm just gonna be honest about it. I like to jump into the trend, get more views about it, but also take the opportunity to communicate. Also take the opportunity to communicate this big problem and I'm going to keep communicating this because I think it has to change and I need a lot of people need to do this in order to start a movement. So I'll just start with it, I might get a lot of hate of it, I don't care because this is honestly what I think about it and this is honestly why I think this egg photo got a lot of likes. So just something that you can bring with you, so if you want to create a post that goes completely viral just as this egg, create something that makes people like your photo because of this reason. Don't actually say what I'm saying in this video, like if you watch the description of the, the photo of the world record egg, this problem is being communicated nowhere. But people liking this photo is linked to the problem. 
So if you manage to be smart and create something that has the same effect, I'm sure you're going to get a lot of likes and you might just blow up and you get a lot of traffic. And we all know traffic is money, which could be really good for you. So that's it for this video. I know it's a heavy one. Hit the dislike if you hate this kind of stuff, but definitely hit the like if you agree, because we need to stop this. And I, I just feel so bad for this younger generation that just feels obliged to post naked photos in bikinis and I don't know, just be insecure as hell, we, where there's actually no point of being insecure. Like, we're not all perfect, we all know that, I think, but Instagram and YouTube and Facebook is actually showing the controversy, so it's just not healthy. All right, so I'll shut up for now. Thank you guys so much for watching again. The next video is gonna be a bit more about how I can help you create an online business. And I'm trying to do that myself, trying to explain this to you guys. So if that's something you're interested in, make sure to subscribe because we're creating a community right here. And uh, I think we can achieve some great things. I will see you guys in the next video.